So I'm going to take a look at this. Someone take a look at this. Rapper Saucy Santana is receiving backlash for direct comments made to a black woman. She ain't have no BBL. Her makeup wasn't done. So now the sisters are tired of this big old gorilla. Now they are. And and let me just make a caution to uh, my uh, white audience if they're listening. Unfortunately, what we have in the black community, there are small hats, right? European small hats that are in charge of choosing which black stars get TV time and the limelight. And they choose certain people to put in our face on purpose. And it is very fitting to certain people in power where they decide out of all the zoo animals that they could have chose, they chose to put a big old gorilla with lipstick, uh, uh, fake nails. And they told this big old gorilla, your job is to twerk. It just, <laughs> and just, just make, just make ninjas look bad. Just a, a complete, utter embarrassment. Just a complete, utter embarrassment. And you know who, who, who are his biggest fans? Our sisters, our, our queens. <laughs> These are his biggest supporters, B-dubs. Now, out of all the stuff he's, he's done, this is where they draw the line here. Because he decided to say something about a sister. Now, they want to cancel him. I'm talking about this man threatened male grape on another man. And they praised him for it. But this is the line they decided to draw, right? So let's see the video. It should be in uh, here. Let's let's listen to the video right here. All right, let's just get this up. Hey, Susanna Boogie. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, how you doing? I don't know why they keep bringing girls out here. Any fun? Are you trying something? I'm not trying nothing. He trying it. He trying it. He trying it. And he trying it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bring some real niggas from back there. And then y'all even got no bad hoes. She had no BBL. Her makeup wasn't done. Like, what are we doing? But like, the hoes need a BBL? Yeah, like, they ain't got no BBLs, no mink lashes, no lace wigs, no nothing. She just came out and said, Tell me, why does a uh, look. Let me keep playing it. Look, I'm gonna do outside. All right, let's just get. So, this is where they drew the line. Now, I, I don't even want to put this ninja on the stream. This, uh, but out of all the things he, this gorilla has said, this. This is the draw. This is the line that BWs draw. I'm, I'm saying like literally ju- like you see the, the comment by DJ Academics right here. He says right here. Just last week, y'all was claiming the hell out of this mentally deranged thing. Now y'all mad. He said what he said. It's it's it's, uh, you know. <laughs> I mean, what what else can I say? First of all, this this. uh this this saucy character. This is one of those people that I, you just you just wish like you don't wish harm on nobody, but you just wish he just goes away. Just just go away, man. Because it's just like people like that. It's not representative of the black community. I'm gonna just put that out there. They like to push that stuff, like especially Hollywood. I believe they 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 literally look specifically for black men that are. Uh, entertainers or uh, uh, part of this alternative lifestyle because if, when you look at the statistics I didn't even notice they look they did like the statistics on like who are in terms of the gay demographic I thought I thought <laughs> the way they pushed it by using black men I thought that black men were like the top I thought they were going to be number one <laughs> they said like it, they, by, by race they go by who who are the uh, who has the most gays by by race? Number one was the uh, the Hispanics. Number two was uh, uh, the Asians. Number three was white, and then number four were the blacks. Blacks. I was like, oh, I thought. Shoot, I was like, I'm like maybe even top three. No, we're not even top three. So it's such a small portion of openly gay black men, but they somehow are literally the lead representatives when you turn on TV. So much show it, it it messed up my mind to be like, okay, there's probably more alternative lifestyle ninjas walking around here than I thought. And maybe ATL is not just one place. But when you look at the statistics, you're you're like, wait. 
So how is it we it's 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 they took a portion of just like they're basically out of all of the men, out of all the black men, out of all of us that they could choose. They choose, they literally are looking specifically for that alternative lifestyle dude. They're looking for any person that's willing to crack the door open, if you know what I'm saying. So this is crazy. This is why I don't, you know, I don't watch BET. I don't watch, like, I don't even watch BET Awards. And thank God I didn't, because apparently the, uh, that gorilla character that they've been, not, not, not the artist gorilla, but the, the gorilla I'm talking about here in this stream, they, he was, apparently he was part of the whole thing. He was, he was, <laughs> it was, it was interesting. People was saying like in that BET show it was crazy. Basically all the men were dressing like women and all the women were dressed like men. Basically all the women had suits <laughs> and men had dresses and long hair and stuff. It's y'all can keep BET dog. Y'all can keep it. Okay. Now we see the BW's uh, reaction to this monstrosity of him. <laughs> so <laughs> out of all the things this was the line that they draw so let's let's look at their reaction they say santana is weird for talking about a woman like this um it's woman not woman anyway because she doesn't have a bbl or makeup on that means she's ugly like you're the very last to be speaking on looks bag bigger than alaska he got some nerve yada 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 them shoes that four-year-olds play in with a sweatsuit and lopsided BBL is crazy. He's wearing kitty heels with sweatpants. He should be the last one talking. Another reaction. He was very nasty to her. How are you going to be rude in kitten heels? Coming from Mr. Grizzly Bear Chick is rich. She was cute. He has a mean spirit. And honestly, he shouldn't have a platform, but neither should a lot of these. But here's the thing. Where were y'all? Where were y'all when this guy came in? But like I said, his biggest fan base is y'all. And now all of a sudden, y'all don't want to claim him no more. <laughs> like Pastor said, by the way, why don't you? Nah, let me not bring that up. Let me not bring that up, man. <laughs> um, another reaction looks like a man here in the photo. He said, just say a gay man should not be speaking on women because they literally want to be like women. But like I said, it's, it's useless for BWs to say that because they're the biggest supporters of that community. And ironically, what's interesting about B-dubs is once they want to shame you, they call you sassy. They call you gay. Oh, you must like men. Basically using that as a diss. But apparently, that would be the same girl, that same girl that say that. And that's across all races, too, by the way. But that same girl, after calling you sassy, after calling you gay, after you making you know, saying what you need to say as a man. And then they just deflect by calling you gay. Those are the same women. They'll have like three or four gay friends hang with them and all that stuff. <laughs> but at, this, at the end of the day, they don't even look at them as men. Now it's interesting from the rainbow community. I don't see the rainbow community calling out straight, uh, heterosexual women or just women in general for doing that. It's interesting to me, but yeah, it's, it's just innocent. So, so, okay. So academic said what he said. He said, now y'all mad. He said what he said. And now look at the response of this specific girl. She says, you deserved it. This innocent girl didn't. And I'm like, what? That's the mindset. I mean, like he threatened a male grape to, to grape academics. And it was fair. fair it was fair game. And girls were la girls were laughing at academics and they were kind of laughing at academics when he was crying because Diddy was about to get him. He thought Diddy was involved. And the reason people don't understand Diddy, academics was crying because Diddy's a predator, dog. <laughs> academics like, I don't want this bummer clot no more. Because Diddy's a monster. But people, but like I said, girls, with, girls was laughing at him. So I don't even want to hear that shit. You know, it's interesting. Let's, let's see. He said, Carisha, come get your puppy. And by the way, I haven't heard a word from Carisha. Ever since Diddy went, <laughs> I haven't heard a word from that girl. I ain't heard from, not from City Girls, none of that. It's interesting. 
yeah, this I'll say he's uh, one of the comments, one of the smarter guys. And he said, y'all empowered those ninjas to think that they can speak on and criticize y'all if they're women. Now live with it. Fact. Facts. Facts. Because any time a man was speaking up against this thing, this gorilla, we were called uh, uh, homophobic and all this stuff. Oh, that means you must be gay, too. And all this. Th- so that's this is not on us stop don't don't make this about ninjas <laughs> don't don't do that don't do that because i already know where like it's almost like with the Derek jackson thing when they find out he was a predator he's like, you see this is why you can't trust these ninjas and i'm like i was like men were telling you this guy was a predator <laughs> men you just did you didn't care you didn't listen okay let's see some of the responses because <laughs> facts but not all of us support this mess nah you're, you you guys need to be louder if you don't support y'all need to be louder <laughs> it was on his team uh, last week when threatening male grape on another man it's crazy <laughs> oy, oy, oy. <laughs> this silverback has a lot of nerve how is someone with the bbl beard bo- combo criticizing him? like i said the reason why he feels free is because he's lgbt <laughs> okay that's why he feels free and like I said, do not, don't, don't come to, don't, do not be coming to men talking about, we got to put a stop. This is, this is your mess. This is your mess. That monstrosity that they've <laughs> allowed. You, you allowed this. You, you did. You did. Don't, don't put that on us. Do not put that on us. <laughs> but man, I, I, I'll, I'm a. I'm going I'm to just leave it at that because there's a lot more things I would like to say that I really wouldn't regret it. I just know that it's going to affect my channel. <laughs> so I'm just going to keep that to myself for now.